guitars and ukuleles with my brother and my dad from the time I was little. And I always really enjoyed selling them because I love to play and I understand the construction so I feel qualified to be able to judge the quality and the value. I don't want to carry everything basically focusing on the best products. The more I can benefit you and the entire ukulele community, the more successful that will be. And so that's what I do every day, whether it's finding and showing you the best ukes and best values out there, or uh, expanding on our educational and um, review resources that we have, or, you know, capturing that, that moment with an amazing musician that really inspires us all. Each customer is an individual coming from a different place, having a different want or need with the ukulele. And we're gonna, we're gonna talk to you and we're gonna figure out you know, what you're looking for. Whether it's your first ukulele or it's you know, a very specific model size that you, know, you have planned out, we're gonna help you find what you're looking for. We're gonna try our best. Every day, you know, we're on emails, we're talking on the phone, but we're also trying to get the product out the door for you, you know, in a timely fashion. But orders come in and some, some ukuleles take longer than others and it's, that's part of our goal because we wanna make sure that you get the best quality product that we can give you What's your favorite part about working in the store? Being able to sell and play ukuleles. <laughs> uh, that, that, that's your answer? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Troy Fernandez, of course, was my idol. Um, he got me into playing. I love Troy. But Troy opened the door for me to uh, discover Peter Moon. And Peter Moon, oh man, mind-blowing ukulele playing. His timing was crazy. His, uh, his feel was just incredible. But then I listen to Peter Moon, and then I get turned on to Mokeale. You know, and I, I mean, there's just so many, so many good ukulele players. Um, you, you look at you look at guys like Benny Chong. Benny Chong, in my opinion, is one of the greatest jazz ukulele players on the planet. Um, phenomenal, phenomenal player. Learning the way an ukulele is, is built and the way it works is a lot deeper than I thought it was originally because it seems like such a simple small instrument but there's so many factors that go into an ukulele being set up properly and being the best it can, it can possibly be. The neck angle and the, the, the relief on the neck and the saddle and the saddle placement and compensation on the saddle on the type of strings you use and there's so many factors that go into uh, set up, setting up an ukulele. It's, it's really actually pretty deep and a lot more sophisticated than I originally thought. So it does take a long time to get used to the instrument um, in terms of doing a setup and what to look for right off the bat. So it's, it's, it's actually quite challenging, yeah.
as we continue to grow, we're learning how to deal with the increased business and increased demand and also trying to maintain the things that we always implemented as part of our original business model, which was our setups and our quality control and our customer service. When you play it, it feels good. And if it feels good, you play it more. The more you play, the better you get. The better you get, the more you want to play. That's the whole point.